I have a, <coughs> a supporter, a beloved supporter of Sheikh Imran Hussein Sabs, who has left a comment saying that he will find me watch. He said, I will find you watch. So if you want to find me, brother, the very video that you have seen, you probably know the area. If you don't know it, it's Camden Town. That's my walk back from my Jummah prayer, so you can wait around there Friday and you're bound to spot me. Um, if that's what you're thinking, you know, for me, from Allah I've come, to Allah my return. And um, he has a username which is in a different language. I put that onto Google Translation and it translates as do what you please. Seems very religious in, in, in Christianity, maybe also the Christianity. But um, his um, channel name is Do What You Please. So being a religious guy and having that motto, brother, two things, these two things are not going together. And if anyone's thinking I'm having disrespect for Sheikh Imran Hussein, you are wrong. I have no disrespect for him. I want to get some clarification. I did email Sheikh Imran Hussein. In the past, he's responded quite swiftly, but on this occasion, I've emailed him about, um, can you clarify for me? I get the impression that you do, want, do not want to say Hazrat Usman radiallahu anhu, may Allah be pleased with him. And um, that email hasn't come yet. Um, maybe the Sheikh's not well. It's definitely cold here. I'm not sure about Trinidad. So I'm waiting a few more days to see if he will respond to me on an email so he can give a clarification. But the video definitely suggests that he doesn't want to do that. And yet no one in the world can escape reading the Quran, including Sheikh Imran Hussain, without the Zer, Zabur and Kasra, because it's impossible.